Terry, this week um, you wrote a, a column about the Jimmy Meter, the product of Valley Forge and Ashland University, playing with the Browns, comes up with the, the play of the game, maybe the play of the season when he blocks the kick. How about this kid? Huh? Well, I was always kind of curious, how did he end up at, at Ashland? Because he's got NFL size. Yeah. And what it was when he's at Valley Forge, he was, at, by the way, he's a very good wrestler, ranked number two in the state in heavyweight. Right. He also took some boxing lessons and even and did some gold gloves for a while. You don't want to mess with this kid, but <laughs> <laughs> he could do a lot of things. So what happened, and Jamie's the first to admit it, he didn't take his uh, study seriously at Valley Forge. Come time to go to college, while some of these schools are interested, there's no offers. Mm. You can't hit the academics. So Ashland was one of the schools interested. So anyway, they set it up. He went to uh, try c for a semester. And he had to buckle down. Now it's the fall. He's not playing football. He's going to school just to get his grades up, right. which he does. Then he enrolls at Ashland, plays four years there. And Lee Owens, the coach, former coach at uh, head coach of Akron U, and also as an assistant at Ohio State, he mentioned something to me when we were talking. He said, you know, after about Jamie's first year playing for us, I mean, he's a Division One player. You could tell. He said, a lot of kids in that situation, you know what they do? Yes. They leave or yeah. go to the bigger school. Right. They, yeah. they try to they transfer even to a right. Mac school. They sit out. He played all four years there. And then they put the challenge on him. We don't just want you to be eligible. We want you to graduate. And he graduated with a degree in criminal justice. And Lee mentioned something else to me. Owen said that a lot of kids, when they think even if they have an outside shot, the draft, the minute the football season ends, they drop out right. and they go to these camps and everything to get ready. Uh, he stayed in school and made sure he finished. So, you know, he had a, he wasn't drafted. The Ravens had him. Got to thank Ray Farmer for this one because the moment the Ravens cut him, the next day Ray Farmer signed him. Right. And not that he's a great player, but, you know, he's going to play in the league a long time. Yeah. And he clearly came up. That's why Joe Thomas loves him, you know, the old, you know, the pierogi prince of Parma. Right. <laughs> But he talked about how he came up the hard way and that. So, um, and as Lee Owen said, if you're building a team and trying to go it from the bottom, you do need guys like Meter, you know, who appreciate where they are, yeah. not just locally, but just get how hard it is to play in the league and do it the right way. Mm -hmm.